Right. Here we are, Tom Friend here with Charles Berger. The uh, little seven on seven on seven action. Well, Colin, this is really the exciting portion of the afternoon. I mean, all day we've been uh, witnessing drills and one-on-one -on -one coaching and, and the talent that all these individuals have. And now we're going to get to see what they can do in some game, uh, t you know, game t time simulation. Yep. Now, right now, as you can see in white, going from left to right, is the offense, and the defense is in black. Nice break up there by the defensive back. Yeah, well, I mean, that was a nice play. It was a nice drop back by the quarterback. He threw a bullet. And the DB just hopped right in front of him. Yes, yes. The formation. That's a touchdown. Oh. That was a long out pattern. The lefty quarterback hit him in stride. As you saw, the DB stepped up, tried to make a play, lost the ball, touchdown. Coach talking about now uh, how that it's important for the linebacker to give the receiver a jam, try to hold him with the line, just don't let him run free downfield. We got DB's trying to make plays, but I tell you what, he tried to cut that one off. He just missed and went for a TD. Yeah, you know, you shouldn't gamble. You shouldn't gamble. Try and give it up. Looking long. Incomplete. He had a man wide open down the sideline. Looked like some mixed up defensive coverage, but yeah. he threw it to the wrong receiver. Yeah, there could have been a slip up there in the secondary. <laughs> but the thing to notice here, Colin, is. I mean, the routes they're being run, they're pretty crisp and solid. The quarterback is has a very nice drop. You know, there's this is the fourth quarterback we've witnessed. And uh, the first three had a great drop step and, and, I mean, a cannon for an arm. Right. No, definitely very fluid. Switching up the defense. <laughs> Coach Payton giving out some last second instruction. Nice pass breakup. Yeah, that was a nice shot by the DB recognizing the route. Stepped up and knocked it away. But sometimes you can't make that pick. Sometimes it's better to just, you know, yeah, so, the ball down. Exactly, Sky just, just, you know, not to gamble. He just said. Yeah. Looking the left side, just incomplete. You know, try to support for people to do their jobs. Yeah. Absolutely, that's the whole point of this drill, you know, getting the uh, DBs just in the right position. You know, it's important where everybody is where they're supposed to be. You know, we're up here. Short. Bingo, bingo, bingo! I oh, dropped it. That, that's oh. got six points written all over it. I tell you what, you know, as, a, as an outside linebacker, you have to make that pick. Yep, no, you, you, don't, you have to. You have to catch that ball. Good point, Charlie. I mean, and you know, this is a combine. It's not like this is practice and you have reps and reps and reps. You can have one or two chances to make a play, you gotta make the play. Right. Lots of time, looking long. 
I don't know where he was looking exactly on that one. This is the BX Strength and Speed Development Combine hosted by Section 1 Recruiting Dot Inc. Excuse me, Section 1 Recruiting Inc.com. What do you say? Something. Quarterback looking long. That ball was thrown into trap, but if you saw, the, the coach immediately came over to the uh, outside linebacker and said, what's the first thing you did? It was back up. You know, it's, it's great instruction. A pump fake. Change up the secondary again. Secondary coach wants to watch some of these picks, but he wants to hear some bingos. I don't know if you could hear it on the camera, but the coach yelling he wants interceptions. I don't blame him. That's a, like the third ball that hit their hand without a pick. That was just an example of excellent coverage. Phenomenal coverage, Charlie. Looks like everybody was was where they're supposed to be. Nobody was open. Uh, maybe maybe there was uh, maybe there was a mishap and looking for a play sure then ran maybe a receiver ran a, a, a wrong pattern. Coach Bagan gets it corrected. We go at it again. Oh, there's an interception. That was nice defensive coverage. Secondary coach giving out the giving out the coverage. That was a really nice check down by the quarterback there. He saw he took his time, he didn't have his man long, and went for you know his secondary target and he hit him uh, right between the numbers on the sideline. Right, you know, it's a good point, Charlie. Maybe something that, that the you know the quarterback's running right now. Is that you know you can play a little small ball, play a little nationally ball, you say you don't have to go for the home run every time. But now they're going for it. Just out of bounds. You know, the coaches are getting a little intense. I think they just can't help themselves. You know, these are professional coaches that love their jobs and uh, you know, they see some game simulation. They're loving it. Yep. You know, they see, you know, even if, you know, these guys never end up playing for them at the collegiate level, you know, they still want to help them and, you know, they still want to help them be the best players they can be. Flat. That was a nice effort. I couldn't tell from the angle if uh, he actually caught the ball or not, but a great effort, diving effort. Yeah, it was tough there. We're right by the sideline, but it looks like, looks like it's a good hustle. Looking way downfield. Oh. Intercepted. Oh. 